Brandon and Vanessa here are a uh, date night that we have every week. We're going to go check out this place. Seoul. Seoul. Midtown. Yeah, Midtown. We decided to come out to Midtown. Uh, this place looks bomb. It's got some good reviews online. Uh, let's go in and check it out. What do you think of the vibe? It's pretty cool, actually. The, the, I appreciate that the music, you can hear it, but it's not where you feel like you have to yell to have a conversation. And there's so many different textures in this restaurant, from like the, the wired like, casing of the lights to, like I mean, even just the background. I mean, everything's so different. It's really, it's like interesting for your eye. Yeah. You're just eating, you just keep on eating and looking. It's, I think we're in Korea. Oh, yeah. Well, there's a really, like really cool artwork all over the place, too. So. Yeah, check it out. My name is Kevin. I'll be, I'll be the server today, so enjoy. Yeah, have a nice dinner, okay? Thank you. So we have a salad with a miso dressing. We have some sides. We have a barbecue sizzling chicken. This is the Korean hot chicken, which I'm so excited to try. And these are the Soso fries. These have an, a, an aioli, sriracha, jalapenos, and bulgogi. So the fries are actually really good. Uh, I feel like it's something that I'm gonna wake up in the middle of the night and kind of crave. You know, like when you have like, or you stay up really late and you have the munchies and you're like, I just really wanna eat something that's not good for me. <laughs> it's gonna be this. So this is the Korean hot chicken. And it's, it's breaded, it's deep fried, but I can't even explain to you how sticky and gooey and crispy this is at the same time. I'm super excited. Honey, garlic, they do use the, uh, the, like the spicy chili paste that they put it in in the marinade. Oh, I'm so excited. Wow. The flavor just jumps out at you. So crispy outer shell, chicken, just solid, not completely overcooked. But the flavor, man, is um, unbelievable. Yeah, absolutely. We just wrapped it up at Seoul Korean. Uh, that place was lights out. Uh, what'd you think? It was really good. Yeah, what was um, your favorite? The barbecue chicken though is actually Really good, however, the bulgogi was like amazing. The thinly cut sliced beef and the flavor, it was really good. Yeah. Overall, I give this place probably a 9.5 out of 10. I mean, you're talking about it had the vibe, it had the food, uh, they had fresh jalapenos on the fries, it was bomb. All their pickled sides were really good. Uh, the fried chicken was good. Um, probably my highlight though, the drinks went perfectly with the food. So you'd have the food and then you'd have a drink. Uh, we both got different drinks and we'd have a sip and, and it went perfectly with the food. Like it, 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 uh, it went well together. You know, like if you ever go to a restaurant and you have a drink and then it's like, I, it kind of takes away from the food. No, this added to it. So this is an amazing date night spot. Best Korean food I've ever had. You gotta come check out Seoul.